All right, guys, so I basically just wanted to make a video real quick on how to clean and condition a leather sweatband on a Western style hat or a fedora or a bowler or any kind of hat that has a leather sweatband. Basically, it's going to be the same process as conditioning uh, anything that you would have that's leather. But uh, I figured when I looked it up, there was no video, so maybe this would help. So basically, what I have here is a leather care kit. Um, comes with a leather cleaner and a leather conditioner uh, but what I find works best for me actually is if I just use this cleaner and then I use this big LP uh, leather preservative and it actually lasts longer than the, just the conditioner they put in there so um, what you're gonna do first is uh, shake up the cleaner now, I don't know if you can see it, but there's like a little light grime on there from sweat or something. It's not too dirty, but it's a nice sweatband. But so what I do is I just get like a little little line of some cleaner on there. And then a lot goes a long way, actually, or a little goes a long way. So I just take that little bit and spread it around with my finger like that. And uh, normally what I'll do is <clears throat> put it on the edge of a table or something like that to support that side that I'm working on and roll it along the edge as I do it to support the felt. But I'll just do it like this so you can see. And then I take a, just a clean rag, dry rag, and rub it in. Normally what I'll do is I'll do half the sweatband and then the other half. Now, when you come in to any part that like this on the sweatband with the um, debossing, you might want to be kind of careful and try it out first to make sure it doesn't rub any of that gold off because it can sometimes. Just like that. And you just be careful not to get it on the felt or on the uh, liner. And then just put a little bit like that. Spread it around. Take the rag, clean it, and get another dry part of the rag. Now, I don't know if you can already see the difference, but it's it's much cleaner than it was. But you can't just clean it because that'll dry it out. So. Now you have to use some sort of conditioner, but instead of using the conditioner, I use, well, this is a conditioner in itself, but it's the Pick LP. And this is like a Vaseline, but I just take a little bit on my finger and kind of rub it onto the leather like that, like I did with the cleaner. This one does suggest to use heat um, if you need to get a easier application. But I, I find that's why I use my finger because just the body temperature from my finger and the friction is enough to get it to kind of melt and spread because it's kind of like a lip balm almost feels like. And this is really good for right around where all the stitching is. All right, and then I take same rag and just a different area that's clean and dry and work that in it's and you're basically just it's like you're rubbing lotion into it because it's basically skin right and same with this be careful where the uh, gold debossing is or embossing or whichever one you need. don't want to rub it off get another Just working it into the leather right here where the seam is too. Where the seams are. And that's it. I mean it's like a brand new sweatband pretty much.
So that's that's pretty much how I do it. And I just check all my hats periodically, and if they seem like they might be drying out, I give it the, the treatment. All right, hopefully that helps any of you guys. Thanks.